we just started seeing them about, uh, I guess just a few days ago, and they started to arrive. You may have seen several monarch butterflies in the last couple of days. That's because this time of year, monarchs are beginning their journey from northeastern United States and Canada to Mexico. A lot of times you'll see them cluster together, and the reason that they cluster together like that is for warmth. Uh, it keeps uh, predators away because once they get a little too cold, they don't move as fast. Uh, but yes, the cold front kind of pushes them on down here, and that's what we'll see them. The monarch's migration starts around the Great Lakes area. It comes down through San Angelo, and it continues south towards central Mexico. It's over 2,000 miles, some say about 2,500 mile journey that they make. As temperatures continue to drop in the Concho Valley, more monarchs will make their way through the area. And there are some things you can do to attract these beautiful insects to your home. There's pollinator gardens that people can put in. Uh, the, the monarchs in particular love milkweed. Uh, that's one of the things that they feed on. Once they've arrived to their destination in Mexico, they stay for the winter before returning home. It's amazing because nobody really knows how they, they kind of have a built-in compass uh, on how to get back uh, to where they came from. They spend uh, most of the winter down there. They start to run out of food, so that, that's what pushes them back up there in their search for food. Uh, so that's why they'll come back through here and then end up back up, up north. And then when it gets cold, they start coming back down. For News Connection, I'm Amanda Lozano.